G'day gang. Here's a cheap, quick, little veggio tart that you can do at home. Pup pastry, you can buy that at home, can't you, Chef? Yes, you can indeed. All right. So all I want to do with that is curl those around the edge and we want to get a little frill, a little bit of puff. You can use short crust if you want. Go, flip it around, flip it around, flip it around, spin it. Frill it, stick it, do it. And we want to poke him. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. And for my next trick, hey presto, here's some, well they're vegetables actually, but that's fine. I want to put some, that's <laughs> an eggplant. I'm going to put a little bit of char grilled pumpkin on top of that. You could call it a little pizzetta, or you could call it a little tart. We're going to call it a tart today, because we like tarts. So there they are, all ready to go. Right, four of those. I'm going into an oven that's about 180, 190 degrees. Get it in there like that. You want to give them about... 15 minutes at 190, getting all crispy on the neck. Time has gone off. Whoa, hot, steamy. So there we are. I'm gonna let them cool just for a little bit. I'm gonna re-pester them. And then I'll put some beautiful herbs on top. Plating vision. There's a little tart up here. So that's obviously our base. Whack him on there. What we want to do now is a bit more pesto, colour, the flavour back of there. You'll bring the pesto back in there. You want to get some nice, a little bit of ricotta. A little bit here, a little bit there, a little bit there. Beautiful. A couple little cherry tomatoes on top of that. All those, beautiful. And some more little micro herbs, which is a micro pasta. Look at that, beautiful. And there you have it. A beautiful little veggio pesto tart.